Artificial intelligence is said to be harnessed at dozens of underground MRT stations as part of rail operator SMRT's efforts to go greener. Optimizing temperature control is the name of the game. The aim is to reduce energy usage by up to 10%. Geraldine Yap with this report. More than half the energy consumed by an underground train station in sunny Singapore is used on air conditioning to keep commuters cool. The magic happens in rooms like this one. And cooling systems are soon to be aided by this little black box. It houses artificial intelligence that analyzes patterns of human traffic in a station and combines it with weather forecasts to predict how much warmer commuters are going to feel. But the air conditioning system currently reacts to conditions in the station and adjusts its settings to reach an optimal temperature of 26 degrees Celsius. But there is a bit of a time lag. And by the time the adjustments are done, conditions might have changed, resulting in overcooling and wasting energy. Now, the AI system hopes to solve this problem by predicting what conditions could be within the next hour and making the adjustments accordingly. The system is being trialled at Paya Lebar and McPherson stations. By the end of next year, SMRT plans to install it in all of its underground stations, which are along the north-south, east-west, Circle and Thomson East Coast lines. This is expected to save over 7,000 megawatt hours per year, the equivalent of powering 1,500 four-room flats. These are part of continued efforts by SMRT to find innovative and sustainable ways to reduce our carbon footprint and contribute to a greener Singapore. The train operator is also using technology to keep its station toilets clean. Sensors pick up the smell of ammonia and detect the number of people who have gone to the bathroom. These can help cleaners attend to a toilet before it gets too dirty.